How to make a nightmare on Elm Street glove. Whether or not you live on Elm Street, creating a terrifying costume doesn't have to be a total nightmare. You will need an empty paper towel roll, a pair of scissors, a ruler, a pencil, duct tape, silver spray paint, a sheet of cardboard painted silver, an old work glove, four brass fasteners, aluminum foil, black paint, brown paint, a felt-tipped pen, a four by two foot sheet of plexiglass, a coping saw, sandpaper, a hot glue gun, and super glue. Optional, dark red paint. Children under 10 should not use a utility knife, sharp scissors, or a saw. Older children should be supervised by an adult. Step one, cut the paper towel roll in half lengthwise. Then, cut two one and a half inch wide strips from the resulting pieces. Cut these strips into four pieces that extend from the bottom knuckle to the tip of each of the glove wearer's fingers, excluding the thumb. Step two, cut away two one half inch wide by one inch long strips from one end of the cardboard, so each cardboard piece looks like a T. Step three, round the top edge of each cardboard finger with the scissors and make a 3 8 inch incision lengthwise down the center. Fold and tape the tabs together so their edges overlap, giving each finger a conical top. If your cardboard fingers now look like popsicles, you're on the right track. Step four, cut a piece of silver cardboard that fits over the back of the work glove, excluding the fingers. Lay the cardboard fingers over the glove so the fingers' bottom strips overlap the silver cardboard by at least half an inch. Step five, poke a small hole a half inch up from the bottom of the cardboard finger that goes through both the finger and the silver cardboard. Attach the fingers to the silver cardboard with brass fasteners to make one big hand piece. Make small incisions at the knuckles of each finger for greater flexibility. Step six, cut the glove's fingertips off and wrap aluminum foil over each cardboard finger. Step seven, paint the handpiece and glove using the black base coat and a brown top coat. To give your glove a rustier look, add a small amount of dark red paint. Step eight, with a felt tipped pen, draw four 12 inch knife blades on the plexiglass. Use the saw to cut them out, sand the edges until smooth and add a coat of silver spray paint. Smaller children can use silver painted cardboard blades as an alternative to plexiglass. Step nine, Attach the handpiece to the glove using the hot glue gun and the blades to the handpiece using the super glue. Then put on the finished glove and give your friends the fright of their lives. Did you know? The original Nightmare on Elm Street was Johnny Depp's big screen debut. 